Sometimes as parents, we often overthink about the activities that we provide our children. But guess what? Simplicity is key. And so today I want to share one simple activity that is, has so many great benefits. All you need for this very simple activity is a bin full of water, some uh, cleaning cloths, and any fruit or vegetable that you have in your kitchen. So as you can see in this activity here, one of the benefits is the sensory experience that she's getting. If you have an older toddler, you can add in a brush so that they can really scrub all around the fruit or vegetable. But for her, she is currently 21 months and so getting that sensory experience and tactile experience is really important. Um, also, as you saw, the water here is full of dirt. So this really gives them a really nice visual instead of just rinsing it under the sink. So this, the benefit of having the water in this bin is that they see that there's dirt and they're able to connect the dots. Remember that your toddler is in, in a cognitive explosion where they're learning everything around their surroundings. So when you give them that visual, you are helping them make all of these neural connections. Hooray, hooray for learning. The other benefit of this here too is the language experience that they get. Um, my daughter, we uh, speaks both English and Spanish, so we are able to reinforce our home language. Manzana, pepino, Papa. <laughs> and of course, we're doing it in English. But this really makes us slow down and be very intentional when it comes to language development. Along with that, one of the indirect preparations of this is that they get to participate in food handling and they get to participate in the home community that they are part of. When they are cleaning these apples and these vegetables, then you can give them the opportunity to cut up those vegetables and cut up the apples and prepare them. Research shows that when your toddler handles food and they are part of the cooking and baking process, they are more likely to have the desire to taste this food. Um, as I mentioned, another indirect preparation for this is that they are giving. They are giving to their home community because guess what? Mom and dad are also going to be eating this apple and this potato. We are making tacos de papa. <laughs> We're making potato tacos. So she is helping her home community, something that the whole family will enjoy. And so when we think about activities, you have to think about how deep these activities truly are. I call it indirect preparation because really what you're doing them is preparing them for life. This is not just an activity where they're going to get wet and splash water all over the place, although that does happen. This truly is a preparation for life. It is an aid to life. And what better way to do it than in a very inexpensive and easy way. So remember, simplicity is key. Thank you for being here for more activities just like this one. Subscribe and follow my family's journey on Instagram where I share activities just like this along with product reviews and a lot of other fun things. Thank you again for being here and I will see you soon.